I am Natasha and I'm a secondary 4 student. Ever since I stepped into Crescent four years ago, I've been given many opportunities to widen my horizon, discover my own potential, as well as hone my leadership skills. Being president of the Student Council has allowed me, with my fellow student councillors, to maintain a certain level of discipline in the student body, as well as be the bridge between the teachers and the students. I have been able to develop my leadership skills through my involvement in organizing major school events. I am also the captain of the canoeing team. And as a team, we train three times a week and three hours each time. It is a very rigorous and busy lifestyle, but I would not change it for anything in the world because I know opportunities like these are hard to come by. Crescent has a nurturing environment, we face challenges and in the process we may make mistakes but each time we learn and grow as individuals and as leaders. Our teachers are more like friends, more like family to us. They give us support and invaluable advice when we need it. They go the extra mile for us, they are there when we need them. I remember my first day of school, I had been standing in front of my mirror, adding final adjustments to my uniform. My father had knocked on the door and asked me if I was ready to go. He told me, you look like a crescent girl. And then he smiled that smile that all fathers reserve for when they're extremely proud of their children. One of my favourite things about Crescent is probably the CCA. I picked Anglong and Kunintang as my CCA because not many places in Singapore have it, so I thought it would be unique. Being a part of the ensemble has taught me a lot about teamwork. And you can't just play a single instrument to form a piece of music. You have to play with the rest of the group so as to form a beautiful piece of music for everybody to hear. Besides teamwork, I've also become a more confident person. In my communicative arts lessons, we often have activities that require us to perform. I don't think that it's so much about being able to perform on the spot, but having the confidence to go out there and perform in front of your peers. One cool thing about being a Sec 1 student at Crescent Girls School is that we get to be the first batch to use the Slate PC. I think it's a cutting-edge technology for education since we use it for writing notes and sending soft copies for our projects instead of having to print it out. I find our Slate PCs to be an innovation for students. Our school really prepares us well for the future by using the latest technology in our education. We are also exposed to different kinds of technology. Take for instance, Hume, a tabletop PC, which I think only our school has in Singapore. By using Hume, my friends and I get to engage in collaborative work as we build up on each other's ideas. We also get to do learning trails outside the school by using technology in the learning process. By going on learning trails, we get to engage in first-hand experiences and learn beyond the classroom. What makes the trail more interesting is that we get to use our Slate PCs and other mobile devices. And I never thought that I could also use technology to practice my art. I like to draw on my Slate PC during breaks, then one of my teachers saw my drawings and encouraged me to join the Digital Art and Manga Club. Recently, we have been learning about scenic paintings, which means that we use natural scenes and do it in our own styles. It is a hard process, but because of that, I learned perseverance and the fact that I should never give up. A crescension is courteous, generous, and sincere, and we embody these values through our activities and interactions with people every day. I'm in Red Cross. Through my CCA, I've learned empathy and compassion. I've also come to realize that I need to be able to think on my feet and react quickly when emergencies arise. Duties that I've taken on in Red Cross have developed my leadership skills and given me confidence in my everyday dealings with people. It is our commitment to teamwork and excellence that make us proud to be Crescentians. This can be seen when we take part in competitions. 
It's not the winning that counts, but the Crescentian spirit we display. It makes me proud to see us strive for excellence. The ties we forge in our various CCA bonds us to Crescent. We work hard and we also play hard, and in doing so, we make a lifetime of memories. Our generosity in action is evident when each one of us goes the extra mile during our secondary two internationalization trips. These trips are very meaningful to us because as an entire cohort, we embark on service learning journeys to various underprivileged parts of Asia. We reach out to those who are less fortunate than us. In so doing, we get to put into action our school values of being courteous, generous and sincere. Another program that we have here in Crescent Girls School is the Internationalization Program. In Secondary 2, I went to Malacca. And in Secondary 3, I went to Vientiane, Laos. One memorable experience that I encountered on both occasions was when I took out my camera to take a picture of the young children. It was then that I realized they had never seen a camera before. They were so amazed that a single click could capture a whole moment. I realized then that I should not take for granted how fortunate we are to be in Singapore. I am very grateful to Crescent for giving me these opportunities for growth at such a young age. If I am to describe Crescent in a few words, at the forefront of innovative learning that leverages on technology. A molder of character. A training ground for excellence and teamwork. A nurturer of confident and well-spoken individuals. It's my second home.